你。Welcome back to the walkthrough. <laughs> I'm gonna do the same dealios as I did before, but how will club slots fare against the mushroom course? This. This is the one that I was saying earlier that I might end up in some unwinnable situations that <laughs> I didn't choose the back tees. There we go. Always double check your settings, I guess. <laughs> Alright, here we go. Forward might be iffy, but I'll see how it turns out because this is a really, really big green. So I think I can control it pretty nicely. As long as I use the Super Baxman. <laughs> yeah, that's pretty good. It got more of a right kick than I wanted it to. Like, you seen that I landed it more to the left so that it would kick to the right, but it did just bounce way, way to the right. Go in, go in, go in. Yeah, that's fine, though. <laughs> as long as I birdie, we are, we are doing all right. Uh, I wonder if Neil will actually uh, mess things up regarding club slots because, you know, I've got the high trajectory with virtually every club. Plus, I've got a whole load of forgiveness on the impact area. And... You know what? Who cares? This is going to be fun. <laughs> You'll be able to see club slots with a finely tuned, maxed out level character. Uh, like, see, I can go four iron here pretty safely. And, and, still super backspin though, just to play it safe. Just to try and keep it within range of the hole, come back in line, there we go. And, she drops. <laughs> Pretty easy, double points, that nets us nine points total. Well, depends on what you, what you got of course, but nets me nine points total, dang it. Uh, I don't know if I should aim right way up here. This might be a bad idea, but we're gonna see! Oh boy! I let it rip! Will I regret the ripper? No, I will not. That turned out pretty good, actually. Alright. Mm, how about... I just use a power shot and five iron. And because the hut trajectory is so high, no spin at all! Ooh, look at that! So exotic of a shot compared to what I normally do. But that's because it's just, it's not gonna roll very much. Uh, wow, it didn't even make it. Interesting. Huh. Well, chip in time! <laughs> you know the drill. I'm moving it a little, little bit to the left because of the wind and uh, the slope. I, I mean a little bit to the left. Yeah, there we go. Something like that. And 5-iron is actually about what I would choose for that sort of trajectory. Oh! Whoa, 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 whoa. That was weird how the camera worked there. It didn't take me to the overhead uh, past the 3D quick enough there. It just kind of... <laughs> that was weird. Uh, stop rolling! <laughs> I know these greens are fast, but still. Give me a break here. Come on, come on, come on. Yeah, there we go. Woo! Yeah, bogeys will still give you a point, but anything higher than that, and like if I would have got higher than that, I mean, I got a bogey or I mean, you know, missed the putt and got a bogey, it would have still gave me one point. Because bogeys aren't really that bad, unless you're going, you know, you're trying to stay ahead of the birdie curve like I always am with a really good character. But you know, but if you get double bogeys, then it's it's kind of kind of dicey. Um. Now, about this hole here, since I got, yeah, I didn't, I, I didn't, well, maybe I should have hit driver off there, but I, I just didn't want to put myself, well, maybe I already put myself in trouble, but <laughs> I just wanna, didn't want to put myself where those um, rock spires are, but in this case, I'm going to have to try something a little, little drastic here. I'm going to try and get between the spires. Hopefully, I don't think this is going to work, though. Oh! Well, that's not bad, it's just gonna blow everything up. <laughs> it's just gonna clear my way over to the green! Isn't that lovely? <laughs> Alright, there we go. Mm, I don't know about this shot. This is gonna be a little dicey. I think I'm gonna end up backspinning with a normal shot. 
I mean, a normal approach shot, excuse me. Yeah, that's that's about how I would want it to go t to the hole. Stop! <laughs> yeah, these greens are so fast. Woof! Three points for the birdie! And... Power shots! By the way, you'll notice that I'm taking a lot of unnecessary risks on the club slots. I don't know why, it's just, I don't know, it's just because it's a fun mode, I'm playing in more of a fun, light-hearted way compared to uh, the normal super low score that I'd normally be going for. Bounce- OH! That's it say, bounce off the box, but, well, it did, but not in the way that I was going for. I should say, I, I, I should say, hoping for, I wanted to hit over on top of the box and then roll out, but eh, yeah, whatever. <laughs> it's fine. Super Baxman, will you control the shots? I don't think you will, but I tried my best! <laughs> you can't ask for better than my best. Um, I'm gonna go to 6 iron, low running shot. And, oh, what, what did I do? Mm, well, maybe it'll turn out good. Oh, that's not bad. <laughs> I would have preferred if it would have went in, but it wouldn't have went in if I would have uh, hit it at the... What? There's a little bit of uphill and side slope there. Is that that surely would have went in otherwise? That was a disappointing <laughs> turnout. Oh, uh, ooh, double points though. That's a much more favorable turnout. Um, okay, I'm holding back to about there and super backspin because it's gonna bounce off the fast fairway. So I need to kind of play for that, and it's bouncing. Long, of course, and it comes back with the backspin. Little, little too much, but as I said, golf not a game of perfects. But it would be nice if it could be. <laughs> Whew. Especially this one. It's practically impossible to get a perfect round on club slots. Uh, if not impossible, because yeah, I mean, just imagine how low the probability would be. Yeah, that's a, I guess that's the best I got. <laughs> Wait, did I have a driver or something? Oh, I had three wood. Dang it! Oh, shoot. Well, that actually mathematically matches up nicely because my three wood plus the iron equals a shot to the green. <laughs> Hopefully it'll stay on, though. I don't know if it will. This is kind of awkward. Ooh, not quite. Okay. Uh, I'll do the seven iron thing and gently run it up to the hole. <laughs> oh yeah! <laughs> I always get a little excited on chip-ins. Even if I may not show it, I feel it. <laughs> I'm gonna try and use the fast fairway here. Whoops, I under hit that. Well, too late now, but I'm gonna try to use the fast fairway to get myself a little bit a little bit more out of this angle, I guess you could say. Wait, should I? Did I get a wood? I did have a wood again. Dang it! Why am I? Why am I always trying to? I mean, why am I accepting which club they give me lately? Off the drive. I don't know. <laughs> I just gotta kind of gotta kind of switch through my clubs rather than uh, kind of dazing out. <laughs> I should also be paying more attention to the slots, like besides the, just the last wheel, because. I don't know, I guess I haven't really been paying much attention to the first three wheels, because I figure whatever I get, I get, but considering that the game is not giving me the ideal uh, clubs for the situation, well, that's that's not very good. I'm gonna putt this anyway. <laughs> Let's see what I can do here. Uh, I think I'm gonna have to go to middle, and it's gotta, get a, gotta give it a good whack here. And... <laughs> There's that twinge. <laughs> I mean, yeah, it wasn't a chip so much as it was a putt, but it still was kind of an uncanny shot because I was putting through a good chunk of fringe. I was putting through a good chunk of uh, um, f uh, fairway. So it was just the whole thing of that I had to judge the, the speed more than anything because if I overhit that and it hit the pin, it would just bounce back out of the hole and it wouldn't have gone in. Alright, play panel, do your thing! Actually, that might have been a bad choice to do. 
<laughs> eh, it doesn't really matter though. I was I was more going for the positioning like straight through here than I was going for the you know the actual thwomp portion. Uh, I'm gonna go yeah more towards this way I guess. Uh, I better not miss hit this. And if I do, I better miss hit it to the left. Okay, I miss hit it to the left. <laughs> I got a little tentative to hit. Um, you know, more on the, the left side of the impact marker because of that, but... Eh, it's fine. It turned out okay. And I moved a smidge over to the right because there's not much break going on here. Just a little, little bitty smidge. And we're halfway done. Although we still got the uh, elf short course, <laughs> that's still a thing. And look at that, they gave me a wood, isn't that nice? <laughs> mm, zippy back, to keep it back into, yeah there we go. Keep it back in place so it doesn't go in any rough or something like that, because there's no way I could not avoid, I mean there's no way I could avoid hitting the, the fast fairway there based on the club that I had to use for a setup and whatever. So, yeah, I'll just control it with spin, because there's a lot of Fast Fairway to work with, and Fast Fairway, as you know, is basically like this green right here, so you can control the ball on it. It's just that it's, yeah, it's harder to do so. But since you, since I had a lot back over there, it's more, it's more feasible. Okay, I move that a little to the left, overhitting that, because it's uphill, and ooh, ooh burn the edge. But it worked out. Okay, this one's gonna be tricky. Because we got the Babam, we've got randomized clubs, and uh, it's uphill. Okay, maybe this is doable. Uh, I'd rather hit more to the left than anything here, so even though I can't see the green as to what I'm landing onto, I think it's gonna land on the fast fairway and then bounce on the green. Uh, oh, 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 oh! <laughs> I thought I was gonna get the first hole in one of the walkthrough. Oh man! <laughs> that would have been just crazy based on what I was given and how it turned out. Uh, perfect sweet spot on auto swing. I don't think I need. I, sh I mean, I should be using that at all here because uh, yeah, I, I kind of need to control its spin. And I can't do that with auto, so away it goes normally. There we go. I think the, the rough had more of an impact there than my spin did, but details. <laughs> I think it would have been fine with auto swing based on how that turned out, but eh, it's fine. Alright, backspin, do your thing to keep it on that flat spot. Back, 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 yeah! And... Nice tap in, didn't move the cursor at all. For a birdie. Three points. And... Smash, 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 smash! Oh! Double points, I seen. <laughs> what did I get, driver? Okay, I'm, I, I, I seen that this time. I noticed that you gave me a smaller club than what I prefer. Don't don't you tell me to use the seven iron. Oh no no no! I'm I'm rocketing the sucker all the way past everything. <laughs> this thing is going to the stratosphere. <laughs> And that's not too bad. I missed the fairway, but due to my miss it, not that big of a deal. I just have a nice soft pitch shot here going over here. I can't, I can't like do an approach because I'm not within 60 yards. So I'm just gonna kind of plop it on there, let it roll out, and see how that turns out. Uh, yeah, that's pretty good actually. Oh wait, 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 no, 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 that's bad. No, actually, that's not that bad. Move it a smidge to the right. Good amount past the mark. And really? Huh, it was more than a smidge. I should have moved it. Stop! Okay, I'm not moving it this time. I'm not moving it. <laughs> it looks just fine. Based on the way it trickled away. Yeah, the double, double points there helped me keep keep within the pointage curve, although it would have been nice to have a uh, uh, double birdie, but eh, eh, eh. It's not like I'm getting mulligans this round like I was the other couple of rounds. Ooh, big time miss hit. That's gonna hit the mushroom. Wait, maybe not. I forgot that Neil's uh, Neil's shot is a lot safer than uh, anything. And yeah, hitting those it makes a thing pop up over there, which may or may not be beneficial to your opponents. 
uh, depending on where they are positioned. So you might be want to be careful about that. But as for me, I don't need to do anything there. I'm just going to hit all the way over to the green. Oh, perfect. Perfect impact area, at least. <laughs> I just need to control it with the spin. It's, it's trying to spin back, but the green won't allow it. Um, I moved it a good chunk over to the left. I'm going to trust that I got it right. Mm. <laughs> there we go. Four points for my ego. And no, no, oh, wait, wait, give me the triple star. Yeah, it seems like you get the triple stars if you get the first two wheels as a star. Uh, it just seems to roll that way, but I don't know if there's, there's some variable to that or not. It just always seemed like that to me. Um, but anyway, I am going to end up playing as to this hole normally then, and then just kind of pulling it back with Super Backspin. Look at that. Look at that. The reason why I did that was because there's more green to work with past the hole than there is in front of the hole. So as long as I can take advantage of it with Super Backspin, I might as well do so. I move that a little bit to the right. And she drops. Times two birdie. Okay, this is the one. I better get something good here. Okay, three woods, not bad. Uh, I don't know if, what I can pull off here, but we'll see. Uh, I'm gonna try and land it on that front play panel. You know, the one further off over to the front right of the fairway here. I don't know if this is gonna work though, because I need to land it on the fast fairway. Oh, that's dicey, because I don't like, uh, I don't want to hit to the green with a three wood. Oh no! This could go badly if I go for it. But I think I should go for it for the fun of it at the very least. Ready? Ready? Oh, I miss it! That's going in the water, probably. <laughs> I will see, actually. I don't know how it'll turn out, really. Oh! Yep, water. <laughs> yeah, this is a this is a doozy of a hole in general, let alone with club slots. Alright, uh, come on, get the chip in, get the chip in, chip in, chip in, yes! Oh no! I thought I had a chip in! I was sure I had a chip in! I think it just bounced just a little bit out because of the, um... It had a little bounce in front of the hole and it hit the pin and bounced back out and it was still moving forward so it ended up stopping in place. I should say spinning forward. So, yeah. Ah! Oh, oh, I thought I pulled off a nice power recovery, even though I, <laughs> I went for the water, but eh, eh. I mean, I went for a risky shot past, the, oh shoot, past the water and everything. This is not good. This is not good at all. I literally have to aim sideways for this one to actually give myself a shot. I didn't think I'd end up this badly. <laughs> Just kind of... Nicked it out there, and okay, we're back in play. And I know I got perfect impact area, but I I don't know about... Because mm, I think I, I prefer to have control over it in case I miss hit on the power. Even though that was a simple shot, and I didn't really need spin on it, probably. <laughs> I like how it still says perfect at the power gauge, even on a putt. Even though that there's there's no impact area to worry about. On a putt, you just kind of putt. <laughs> you just it's just one, one then two, not one two three. All right, double points for the last as usual. Um, where should I be pushing my luck this time? How about I try landing it in the bunker and kind of kind of working it over onto the the fairway? I think this is actually a safer shot than it looks. We'll see. Oh, I overhit that. Interesting. Well, eh, that's fine. I can make the green in two anyway. It's just a matter of getting myself in a decent position with a decent, yeah, <laughs> a decent approach shot potential. I need to be like, I want to hit into the front portion of the green, but I don't know if this is actually, oh shoot, I overhit. I don't know if this is actually going to work, especially now that I overhit it. I might actually be going out of bounds because I overhit this, but we'll see. Ah, no. It wasn't It wasn't a low enough trajectory for me to go out of bounds, I guess. Um, I'm going to go uh, six iron with approach. I'm, yeah, I'm going for the chip in here. 
<laughs> of course. And go, 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 go! <laughs> I don't have a mulligan to retry it and everything. Alas, alas. I tried my best, but I'm gonna have to settle for birdie on this part 5. <laughs> and with that, I'm gonna end off the part here. I hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you in the next part. Post your score if you'd like. <laughs> Woo!